Good morning everyone, it's Joker, and today we are back with another slime video. And I've seen a lot of people ask me this question, how do I unlock XX area? What are the requirements? Because it doesn't tell me or I don't know where to find it. So, I'm going to make a video showing you all the different requirements that you need for each area and a very, very, very brief description of what each area gives you without going into too much detail because it's covered in other videos. But your central temps, to, you can get to this screen, by the way, by just going to your home screen and then clicking on your map icon up on the top right side. And it'll scroll through all of the areas. So world map, and then it'll take you here. So you click on central tempest, it, you know, this is your basic unlock area. But to unlock the riverfront area, which is just cosmetic, it doesn't really give anything. Each area does give you access to more bond conversations in total. So you could have more conversations with a larger list of people. Every area brings more. But the riverfront requirements are 18,000 citizens clearing chapter 7 episode 9. And it's purely a cosmetic area. It doesn't have any real gameplay changing values. The Kingdom of Ingracia brings a lot of gameplay changes, brings you the foreign trade function, brings you access to Valor Cup, and it requires a 12,800 citizen count and clearing Chapter 9, Episode 14 on the beginner difficulty. This, I think, is one of the most impactful unlocks in the game. It gives you access to talking to all of the different kids plus Yuki in the area. Uh, foreign trade, you can find some really good stuff in there, gold hammers. The new Crystal Hammer might be in there, and the new Sublime stuff for the Super Awakening. Valor Cup is important for Crystal income and just more content. Next up is the Bamboo Grove, and that takes 60,000 citizens, clearing Chapter 20, Episode 8, Expert Difficulty. And this unlocks another building area, and the Resonance feature for Charms, and the ability to have Bond conversations with Romarus and Beretta. Resonance I've covered in its own video, so if you want to know more about that, just search Resonance in my channel and it'll come up, or Char yeah, Charm Resonance. Next, we have the Tourism District, which just came out a couple months ago for the Season 3 anime, but it needs 33,000 citizens and needs you to clear Chapter 21, Episode 7 at the beginner difficulty, and it unlocks Gear Enchantment, which is super huge. It's a lot of extra power on all of your gear, so it's, I think, the second most impactful place as far as gameplay is concerned. Ingracia beats it by just having a whole, like, ranked and unranked section of Valor Cup. Uh, enchantment is a lot of raw power to your, your weapons and gear. And it also unlocks the ability to conver have conversations with Hinata and Masayuki. And then finally, the brand new Crystal District area needs 50,000 citizens, and needs you to clear Chapter 26, Episode 8 on the beginner difficulty. And it unlocks, when you maxed out, the ability to have conversations with Lumi and the new Super Evolution feature for gear, which is just two additional star levels and more raw attack, HP, or defensive stats for any one piece of gear. I haven't actually super ev evolved any piece of gear because I don't have the materials for it right now. But it is possible for you to do so. And that's all six areas. Like I said, um, if we get rid of all these right here and we go take a look at our home screen, you can see that we have an entire list of people we can talk to now spread out among all the different areas. If you meet some of the, re the requirement for one of these areas and it doesn't actually unlock, just reset your game. Like, close it out, close the app, and open it back up, and it should unlock after that. So, you got kids down here, you got three up here in the Crystal District, seven, six, 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 one, two, yeah, six. So, we have a long list of people we could talk to at this point, because each area unlocks more slots. But... There are the unlock conditions for every area right now as of October 20th, 2024 in Slime. Let me know if this video helped you out, but that's it for me. Take it easy, and I'll see you all later.